Brian, and then defeat, but a lot to be proud of of that performance. Yes, it is, but we spoke to the girls in there. It reminded me of the Hibs game. We let a good side go to and up, and then we react to it. We've actually got good possession in the final third of the pitch, and we lose the ball twice, and they counter us and counter on us and score two goals. So from that aspect, it's disappointing. Second half, I thought we were the better side by a country mile. There's a huge talking point in the 57th minute when Tyree Butchell's pressing the centre half. She gets in, she's getting there, and she gets clawed back. It's a penalty kick from, in my eyes, and it's a red card. It changes the whole complexity of the game. The Lino says to us that he told the referee there's contact. The ref comes over because I'm shouting and gives me a yellow card for it. I'm, I need to be careful what I say here because I don't want to get myself into baller, but that's unacceptable. That's a massive decision in the game. It's hard enough when you're playing against these full-time outfits to go and get a result, but it's a huge, huge point in the game where we're right on the front foot and I'm disappointed my girls because I thought second half they were brilliant. It's a feel of disappointment because they deserve a lot more from that game. They did, of course they did. And I, I probably criticised them the other night against Spartans for not moving the ball. I thought at times against a good side we actually moved the ball at times and we looked assured on the ball, which was a lot more pleasing today. But then it's, we speak to the girls it's, at small margins, it's final decisions at times when we're in that final third. We've spoken about it now for the past six months. We need to get better at it. We need to slow down and be a bit more composed in the final third and pick the final pass. There's an opportunity when young Tyree is in, when she has a shot, but there's an easy pass for a tap in. She'll learn from that because, don't get me wrong, I fought her in big jail with the two young girls. I thought they were phenomenal, I thought they were brilliant. I thought my goalkeeper was really brave at times. Overall, I thought my players played well, but it's just a disappointment of losing game. Okay, so now we're picking ourselves up to head of a massive game at Fur Hill next week against Aberdeen. Exactly, we want as many punters there as possible to support the girls. It's been a really tough start to the season. Three out of the four games have been against the full-time team, so now we're getting to next month and we need to go. We've got three games where we need to take maximum points and the Celtic game will take care of themselves. Unlucky today. Thank you.